with society the way it is now and everybody just, you need to be safe with your information and just with everything that you put out in the ether anymore because you, you never know, you just don't know. One of the best things about cybersecurity is our structure. Um, the, we bring in um, structure every single day so the students know exactly what they're getting. Network Plus and Security Plus, there are two, there's two exams you have to take to get through the class. The first section is networking, Network Plus. Uh, so we spend several weeks working towards that certification. That shows you how data moves to a network. After that, you need to learn how to secure your network. So the next five weeks, we focus on Sec Plus. Sec Plus is really big, and when it's trying, trying to find jobs, it's big in the DOD world. It's, uh, it really helps you with a Net Plus, Sec Plus, those two combinations really do help get it, get, you, get your foot in the door for the employer, so. Prep for network, or Net Plus and Sec Plus, um, study. Put in the work, without a doubt. Don't, don't sell yourself short, and when you think you know it, realize that you don't know it and keep studying. Uh, it was like a completely different language for me and so put a lot of time, a lot of effort. Instructors were phenomenal and took their time, really, really care. The most challenging part has been absolutely everything that this program offers. Because I have no IT background, um, I had to actually put in extra work. After that, we go next four weeks, which is uh, the cyber range. It's a worldwide range that we're very proud of here. The range has just been um, uh, like a Narnia for me. It's just opening up a door to something completely new, something I've never seen before, something I would never have seen without 1150 and the opportunity to get my hands on. Training on the range has actually been quite, it, it's an invaluable tool. Um, I try to get on there as much as I possibly can. I've actually stayed late after class a couple of times and ran through a couple of scenarios by myself. There are 14 simulated attacks. Uh, you don't know which one it's going to be until you, until you figure it out at the very end of the scenario. But the instructors launch an attack and you have to go through firewalls and uh, other detective devices we have on there. You get to work with different people that have different skill sets. So you have one person that is good with the coding and one person that is good with communication and one person that is good with, um, you know, with the, how the programs work. After you've been through the range scenario and then the blue side to show how you harden it, you actually learn how to do the attack. Um, so you can see what the attacker was thinking or, and put yourself in the attacker's shoes. The preparation of learning all the things that we've we've gone through, and then being able to actually practice and see how all of that information works together, I think it's been huge. You don't have to know everything about a network coming in or a computer, but if you are you willing to go home and and learn and put the time in and the effort in. The best piece of advice I would give a new student here at 1150 would be to admit that you're a sponge and just absorb every piece of information that you're offered, every resource that you're given. Um, take the time, put in the effort, and it will be, it will, the payoff will be amazing. Find what keeps you motivated. It's, you, you are going to be the person who needs, who needs to keep you going forward. I think the, the biggest part is being curious and wanting to know, how is this happening? Why is this happening? How do I make it stop? Or how do I figure out the next steps. And, and just know that every single instructor is here to help you better your, yourself and, and your career and your life and they really, really, truly mean what they say. So utilize all of it.